My name is Matt B. I'm a DJ out of Chicago. I've been DJing for a good 16, 17 years now. Just got into producing maybe two to three years ago. It's always been uh, something that I've, I've looked forward to doing, just haven't uh, really made it happen until now. I got into house music listening to the radio like most uh, children young people growing up in the 80s in, in Chicago listening to Hot Mix 5, WGCI, WBMX. I was very fortunate to be young enough but to catch that before you know, it was taken off the air and then later down the road listening to B96, Mixmasters, Bad Boy Bill, Julian Perez, those guys really took it to the next level to where I wanted to be on that level. So that's how I got my start. DJs and producers that have influenced me, there's, the list goes on and on, but being from Chicago, Bad Boy Bill was a, a major influence growing up as a kid. His, his skill, his music, his selection, just everything about him. And what he did, we all tried to manipulate, we all tried to be like, we would record his, his mixes every, every chance we got. And uh, others would be, you know, Felix the House Cat, which is a good friend of mine. He's always been on, on, on another level as far as music. He's been doing electro, house, acid. He's, he's done it all. Harry Romero from New York, um, Eric Murillo. Those guys, those guys opened the doors for a different style, in my opinion, as far as house music goes. Um, another would be Oscar G out of Miami. Uh, he, he gave me an experience one time when I was on vacation in Miami and he opened my mind to a whole different sound of this darker, deeper, tribal house music that I really never experienced before. That just, that just, that just, it just blew my mind how, how many people were really inside this huge club and just really were just, just going off on it from, from, from dancing to just, just sweaty, deep, dark house music. And since then, I, I, I really had this, 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 this soft spot in my heart for, for the deeper side of the house music stuff. You know? And uh, first time hearing house music, about five years old. Um, came across on the radio one day and my older sisters had the uh, had the cassette deck that they used to record mixes on and I remember just just listening to their their mixes they would record from the weekends and uh, it's pretty much the birth of a house for me uh, house you know this 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 music uh, saved a lot of people and Myself and, and included uh, from you know from the streets, from the gangs, stuff like that. I grew up in a pretty rough neighborhood, and uh, you know we, we kind of shied away from that, you know, because we started DJing and um, really just 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 DJing got us got, got us you know away from that and. Um, you know, who's to say what, what, what would have what would have been if, if it weren't for, for this stuff? It, it, as cliche as it sounds, you know, um, everybody says, oh, you know, the music uh, saved my life. Uh, a lot of times it does. Um, I'm sure a lot of people have uh, have the same situation or story. I think the industry's pretty flooded right now. Um, there's there's a million DJs. Everyone's DJ now. Everybody's doing it. Some for the wrong reasons, and you can't knock them. But 
I think I think it's flooded to where it, it makes it hard for the genuine. You know, and I'm not saying everybody's not genuine, but it, they make it hard when it's so saturated and everybody's doing it. I just think I just think if you're not going to do it for the right reasons, just don't do it at all. I, 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 I'm, I'm a true believer in the culture. I'm a true believer in, in everything about it and ever since. So just just having the passion for it, I, I just I just want people to do it for all the right reasons. We're not gonna always have that. You're always gonna have, you know, the commercial and the underground. So whatever it may be, just just do it for the right reasons and for the love. That's that's just how I see it. Another, I think you, you might always remember me from either good or bad. Either you're gonna like it, or you're not. But I, I do this for for the more for the underground because I, I, I feel like I feel like like it, it's not necessarily more genuine than others, but I feel that that it, it has a soul, it has a meaning, it has it, it, it has a life that. Never gonna go anywhere. You know, you're always gonna have underground, overground, or whatever you might call it. But I, I just, I hope I leave a, a good taste and a good sound in everybody's mind. You know what I mean? <laughs>